What's going on everyone and welcome to this video. Let's get my head a little bit bigger there. What I'm going to do in this video is talk to you about exactly how to use Helium 10 to find products. We're going to do a full review tutorial and I'm also going to give you a discount code, a coupon that you can use to actually get 20% off this tool for a long, long time. So without further ado, I'm Hayden. Let's get my big head out the way of the screen and let's dive into it. So first of all, in this tutorial, let's go through pricing, which is one of the most important things. So how much does it cost to actually have Helium 10? Okay, so first of all, you've got the starter package here, and then you've got platinum and you've got diamond. I know what you're thinking, probably, oh, that's quite a lot, you know, but look, you can get the starter package here, and I'll go through exactly what you'll get included in the starter package here, which is the essentials to get you started. However, I would recommend long term, you want to be on the platinum one here, the platinum one, which has got all of the essential tools that you're going to need and the diamonds probably unnecessary unless you're doing some serious serious numbers um if you do want to do that make sure you don't do it without getting the 20 percent off for six months in my code there once you click on the link it will take you straight through to that uh, and then you can get 20 percent off these plans as well so it's not too bad when you get the 20 percent off but let's dive into the tutorial and show you exactly what you get for this money okay and i'll mention the difference between the starters and the platinum and the diamond as we go through the video so without further ado let's start okay i've made some notes here let's get a good start here so the first thing you'll notice here is the x-ray chrome extension tool so if you click on this one here this is what i'm referring to here we've got x-ray here amazon product research we've got x-ray of the keywords which is still in beta and then we've got the async grabber here first of all let me show you what x-ray is now x-ray by the way is what comes in the basic plan okay uh, and obviously it continues to go in the plans as we move up but this is the 29 dollars a month well minus that with the 20 percent discount code um, this is what's included you get access to this x-ray tool here and this is a pretty powerful tool so you can use this to do your analysis on these softwares on the on this these products that you're looking at on a daily monthly weekly basis and you're going to see multiple things here which i'm going to go through now you will see search volume up here we can click into the search volume here click all time click the year we can run over and actually see the exact search volume we're getting we can apply some more filters here like the amazon and then google search as well how much people are searching for this on google so it's really quite fascinating it's going to show you the basic stuff that you need to know before you go ahead with the product for example total revenue average revenue average price etc the total search volume of that keyword okay we can then use it to apply filters here for example let's apply the the, the sponsored results here we could check what the first 10 for example are the average price there we can see the sales the exact sales we can see the revenue the bsr and also the fees that that product's going to cost us we can see the review counts here see what the average review and just work out if it's going to be too competitive for us to actually compete because obviously the more reviews we've got the more hard it is to be on to, the harder it is going to be to knock these guys off the top spot there so X-ray can be used for multiple things. You can find suppliers on Alibaba by linking into here as well. Um, and then also with X-ray, what we can do is not only do it on the, uh, not only are we going to do it from the keyword there, but you can also click on the actual product, run X-ray again here. And then what it will also do is start showing us the exact revenue that a product's going to get and more information about any particular product that you're looking into on the um uh, on the Amazon site here. So you can say once this is loaded, um, we've actually got all this product's information here. We can see the uh, search volume for this. We can see the sales for this. Look, the search volume for this. We can scroll over here and we can see the review counts of each variation here. So it's pretty cool. You know, it's pretty cool. You can also click onto these sellers' stores here with X ray. Let's click onto the store there. We can click on their store go over to their storefront here. We can use X-Ray here as well. We can click the product research here, load the X-Ray and what it's gonna show us then <laughs> is there you go. It's gonna show us all these products from that store and the sales that this product's getting, the total revenue that this product, that this whole store is generating from all these products. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It does a lot of stuff. Um, also on top of that, let's run back to the main search that we have back here. On top of that, baby clothing, let's do, for example, let's type in baby clothing. 
What you can also do is click on this, go to ASIN Grabber here. We can grab some of these ASINs and do further research. Okay, so once this is loaded, you will see that we'll be able to do further research on all of these ASINs here. Just takes a little while to load sometimes. Click on that ASIN, for example, Run Cerebro, which I'm going to go through later on. It will load the data in here. And then what we can do with that data is then go ahead and find the exact keywords that we're going to need to actually rank these products. The keywords, once we've typed in the minimum search volume that we want, for example, it's going to come up with all these keywords. And I'm going to go through Cerebro later on, don't worry. And then we can find out what the organic rank is for these keywords, the search volume. And then we can click into them and use X-Ray once again, once we've opened it up to find out if we can compete. We're using the X-Ray tool. So that's cool. I mean, that's a lot of stuff that you can do with X-Ray. There's some more stuff, but I'm not going to go through every single thing um, because obviously we'd be here all day. So that's the X-Ray. That's the majority of the X-Ray tool to go through. Let's go through. Um, let's go through. I think we should now go through a few of the main tools that we've got on here. So what you're going to notice here is the dashboard here. So when you actually go on the dashboard, which I'm not going to do because it's got my private information there, but the dashboard is going to give you an overview of the profit that you can make and stuff like that, the profit that you've made, the sales that you've done, which is cool. Um, but also what you'll mainly notice here is all of these tools up here. All of these tools here, um, which you can use for your product research. So let's go into black box, for example. Let's go into black box. So black box here, um, we can click on products, we can click on keywords, competitors. And let me give you an example here. What you can do is start typing in the filters that you want for say, let's do keywords, for example, actually. We can start typing in the keywords that we want, the categories that we want. Let's do baby products as we just search for that. Click search here, click any filters that you want. Search volume, for example, let's also put 200 search volume click search and what we can start doing is narrowing down the sort of product that we want to find and then it's going to come up with the keywords that we want here and then tell us how much search volume they've got the monthly sales the monthly revenue the reviews etc and then what we can obviously do is go ahead and view that on amazon and then use the the, the x-ray tool that we just used to then do further research to see if we once again we can compete um, and this is going to get the brain going this is going to get the, the ideas going and also it, it shows you quite easily what products you can actually compete with. What products can you compete with, okay? Um, in terms of turnover and in terms of reviews. So let's move on to this bit now. So when we click on tools here, what we can also do here is click on Cerebro. So I told you about Cerebro in the, in the, in the, in the, in the recent uh, um, section just back then. So Cerebro is, is, is something that you're gonna need, okay? Click on that ace in there, for example. Cerebro is what you're going to need to find the keywords for the products that you're using. So if we do search volume, for example, the minimum, the maximum, you can type in all the filters that you want here. Um, let's type in Amazon's Choice. Let's do no badges, for example. No Amazon's Choice badge there. Click the search here. Oh, didn't come up with anything. Okay, let's take the Amazon's badge off there. And as you can see, so we're using this product, wherever product that you find that you think is good, you type that in there, type in your search volume, your filters that you want to find, and then you use all of these keywords here to actually then go ahead and put them into your listing. So you click on that open Cerebro again, uh, open X-Ray again, figure out what keywords you are going to use to rank this product up here and it's going to show you the search volume it's going to show you the organic rank there it's going to show you the cerebro score and the cerebro score works really well by the higher the score the, the, the better it thinks that you're going to be able to rank that product against competitors for example so puppy heartbeat comforter for example it thinks that that's got good search volume it thinks that it's probably low competition i would assume there we go only 80 results and then if we clicked on x-ray we could see there's probably not that many reviews for it which means there's room to compete, okay? Uh, and then also we can see they are organic rank 53. So what you would do is type in competitors of products, their ASINs, and you can start to figure out where they're ranking from, which is really, really cool. Let's have a look at some other stuff on here as well. So let's look on tools again. Uh, magnets are very similar thing here. What you can do is type in, let's say baby clothing, for example, which is what we did before, late baby clothing. And then that's also going to be another way that you can find them keywords, them really, really important keywords to rank your product from. 
once that's loaded up. If you got to this stage of the video, make sure you type in pink unicorn Amazon seller. I just like to know how many people are actually with me watching this far. So if you type in the search volume here, for example, let's do 200 and then maximum 1,000, uh, hit apply filters. And once again, we're getting a similar effect here, but not just the keywords that that ASIN is ranking for or that it's showing up for that because we don't want to miss any. Right. So if we type in baby clothing, it's going to come up with all another another set of keywords. We've got to go through the same keywords, analyze them, open them up in uh, open them up in um, X-ray on the main page. Check if we can compete with them in terms of reviews, v sales, etc. Hit the magnet IQ score, which is similar to the Cerebro IQ score. The higher, the better. And then eventually what you're going to do is find a big old list of keywords that you can use that are going to be really powerful to put into your listing, put into your title, put into your back end keyword search and everything like that. Um, and yeah, it's just going to tell you the search volume and everything here as well. And then it's just a case of building it all up, building all this stuff up, guys. What else should we have a look at in here? So obviously there's loads I'm going to go in here, guys. We're not going to do a full like hours long tutorial because no one's got time for that. Um, but another thing that we want to probably jump into is the, the keyword tracker there. You could I, obviously I can't click on that because it's got all my products on there. Okay, so I'll be exposing that to potentially hundreds or thousands of people. When you click on that, you could add your products to it and it will track the keywords they will rank in for once you put them in. And then if you lose a spot on the on the rank, it will tell you. And then you can deploy PPC to it, or you can improve the pictures, etc., or drop the price, or whatever, whatever you need to do to get that rank back up. So it's sort of an alert, if you like. And this does have alerts as well that get sent to your emails as well, by the way. So we've done Cerebro, we've done Magnet, we've done Blackbox, okay. Um, and then you've got all of these other things down here, okay. So you've got the Learning Hub here, which I'll talk to you about. So if you click on the Learning Hub. This is included in the, which package is this included in? I think this is included in the Platinum package. Yep, so the Platinum package you'd have to be on for this. And we've got the Exit Ticket, which is a course, Amazon PPC Academy, and the Freedom 3.0. Basically, the, the only free courses you're ever going to need, and they're, they're, they're for free, they're included in the Medium Helium 10 package. It's all included. Um, so that could potentially save you 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 pounds, which is probably what these ones would cost if you were to actually buy them separately um, because they're, you know, they're a lot of value. There's a lot of people that would be selling them for that sort of money. So it definitely saves you the money there. That's a really good bonus to have uh, as a tutorial there. Um, let's have a look at what else we can do. So we've got the listing builder there, which I haven't used, AI-powered AI listing optimizer. Let's have a little look at that. So what you can do, create from scratch, what we can start doing is get some ASINs here. Um, let's go and get a random ASIN up here. Uh, let's click on this one here, whatever that is. These earbuds here. Let's grab that ASIN there just for fun. Whack that in. What's this? I'm sure what's coming up here. Um, get keyword suggestions. Oh, there you go. So you start typing in your top ASINs and stuff like that. And then it's, go it's going to start creating you with AI uh, 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 a listing, which is actually really cool. I didn't even know this was in here, guys, because they're always adding a load of stuff here. So that's really, really cool. Um, you've got Atomic there, which once again is included in the higher packages. Um, and that's where it tracks all your PP spend and everything like that. We've been through there. Um, and then we've got things like look, scribbles here. Scribbles, which I haven't used myself, guys. But you can start to create your listings here with Scribble. So, you know, you pick your marketplace and everything like that. Add your phrases in here. Let's say, um, let's type in coffee pods, for example. I don't know. Um, move my big head over there. Click apply. And then what that's going to do, I assume, is tell us when we've used it. Okay. So let's type in coffee. Because I haven't actually used this, guys. Coffee pods. There we go. So that it told us that it's in there already. So we're not going to use it again, but you would put all of your keywords in here and make sure they're all being used. And then it's going to equally, you know, sort of get all this into every single one here. So I think that's really cool.
yeah so it just assists you to building that list in basically guys okay so look i'm not going to run into loads more because i think you know there's just tons that we can go if you make sure you get the coupon there which is six months off with uh hayden 6m20 there and hayden hayden 10 there if you want 10 percent off every month for life or six months you can get 20 percent off there guys um so yeah that's the sort of thing that's what it looks like inside helium 10 there's loads of different things we can do there as i say we're not going to go in for it into it forever because you know we would literally be here for probably an hour and a half two hours but maybe i'll do one in the future so i hope you enjoyed that and i will see you in the next video